Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. And in today's video, we are going to help you determine the polarity for CLF molecule. It is the chemical formula for chlorine monofluoride. And to find out whether it's polar or non-polar, we will first look at its Lewis structure. So the Lewis structure for this molecule is quite simple because it has one chlorine atom forming a bond with one fluorine atom. And its linear structure might give you uh, an idea that this is a non-polar molecule. But wait, we shall first look at the electronegativity values of both chlorine and fluorine atom because if you know fluorine is the most electronegative atom here and uh, it has an electronegativity value of 4.0 whereas for chlorine it is 3.2 and this difference is higher than 0.4 which is 0.8 and obviously the bond between chlorine and fluorine atom is a polar bond. The bond between chlorine and fluorine atom is a polar bond. As a result there will be a dipole moment resulting towards uh, the direction of fluorine atom and as there is a dipole moment which is not cancelled out there will be poles formed in this uh, molecule in which the regions around fluorine atom will have partial negative charges and the regions around chlorine atom will have partial positive charges and as there are poles formed in this molecule CLF or chlorine monofluoride is a polar molecule. I hope this video helps you to understand that and for more such videos on Lewis structure molecular geometry polarity of the molecules make sure to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching